Oh, Humphrey's belly is huge. Sure looks easy to get lost in here. But if I yell and make an echo... Echo, 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 echo. Where do you come from? Welcome to my lair. Are you surprised to see me? I'm always here. I'm inside me and all around you. I'm everywhere. Or am I just here? Wow, that's so cool, Humphrey. Wish I could do that. It's kind of gross if you ask me. Wow, so rude. There are many ways to go. Where should we even start? Left, right, up, around. Doesn't matter. It's all forward, isn't it? Just pick one, it's easy. Okay, so we actually do have control here. I'm gonna go up here so I can try to talk to the squares. Hi, I'm Humphrey. I'm your all-access past Humphrey, aka Slime Girl's Lair. Strictly speaking, I guess I'm what you humans call an elevator. Unfortunately, we can only take one appointment at a time, so you have to wait your turn. Though, if you can find me a slimy keyboard, keycard, I might be able to pull some strings for you. It's only funny the first time, Humphrey. steal my things again. Well, not this time. I prepared something extra special for you today. As you know, I'm a very busy person. But alas, you are my sister. I'll grant you access to my room, if you are able to sell my little gift. Hope to see you soon, darling. If you're still alive, it is. Gee, popped in just so I was in the middle of fixing up this tube. Stuck, I can help you out a little, or maybe a lot. I'm, pre I'm preparing the entrance for an exciting new attraction, but it's not ready yet. You should come back later. Like tomorrow later. No, Amori, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking to yourself, Wow, sis, this is a weird place to set up a picnic. Well, let me tell you. It may be recommended only set picnics in normal places like in forests or campsites, but where's the fun in that? What if I want to study the anatomy of a whale while I eat? Then what? Expand your mind, Amori. I need to set an example for my sometimes boring little brother. Just that we're having a picnic. You guys, we can't relax right now. We have a puzzle to solve. Aren't you guys afraid the bomb's going to explode? Just relax, Aubrey. We got this. This room's full of the smartest people I know. That doesn't make me feel better at all. The lady on the screen said she set up for her sister, right? She wouldn't really let it explode on her sister. I don't know, Kel. Aubrey's right. We're in an unfamiliar territory. It's probably better to play it safe. What do you think we should do, Mari? Huh? Oh... I think you should do what your heart tells you. Thanks, Mari. I can always count on you. You're welcome. And with that, we are done there. I don't think we got any fights to last healed, so it should be topped off. A floating mirror. Your friends smile warmly behind you. Puzzle, theme, memorization, difficulty, hard.
type puzzle type pattern to fairly easy. Multiple choice, difficulty medium. Here we go. Everyone loves multiple choice, right? I imagine we probably have to do all three. So we have to go over here to get the password. So I assume that's a lamprey? Mailbox. I guess that would be her. She using this is I could get a different accessory, but I don't care. Anyway, we need to get a hero out here. He's the only one who can talk some sense into these things. Hey, it's these guys again. We're your magic hero. Greetings, sir, conveyor butt. My companions, and I require your assistance in changing directions of your conveyors. Will you and your friends please aid us? Nice person. Get lost. Oh, that's strange. That worked so well before. Don't be so down, hero. It's probably just got his gears all mixed up or something. Can you say that any louder? Yeah, it's getting even more mad at us. Hey, Scrappy, you'll turn those bolts around for us, won't you? Rude person. Just like Molly. I can't believe that worked. Well, what do you know? Looks like I'm pretty good at this charm thing, too. Huh, must be hereditary. No, I do want to fight one of these, just see what they do. Warm bot. Oh, so much for my lamprey theory. I'm gonna ricochet off and just see what all it does. This will tell us how durable the sucker is. I just want to... Well, since I don't do the camera, you can't see me very small. Before you ask, no, I'm not going to be doing the camera anytime soon, as in years and years and years. Assuming YouTube's even still around by then. It's worth 2,000 EXP all on its own for the most part.
actually did kill it. I thought it would take more than that, but sure. 4,400. Got watermelon juice. Everyone hit 28. Hero can now mesmerize people. Or things. And out of curiosity, can I speed up the battle animations somehow? Looks like a job for Aubrey. Okay, she must have busted it, I just can't see it. Can't even see what letter that is either. Which one's in a cage? Within a large frame. We already have that one accounted for. Mine in a dark cell would be I, which is already for framed faces. Q is the elevator. I've seen where R is. Captured in a steel trap. Could be that one. Ah, credits W. It's gotta be, because that's our welcome. RUW? Nope, it was V. Or is that Y? I can't quite tell. It was V. This thing wouldn't be as bad if the enemies actually had juice levels that you could affect, because to my knowledge they don't. Or if running the amount of juice was just as deadly as HP, maybe that would make a little more sense. I should explain for those of you who are listening along and not actually watching. Uh, homework caused you to start in this battle in the sadness aspect. <laughs> very, very apt. taking live footage of us. Say jeez. How about fuzzy pickles? We look so cute. Almost makes what you wish we had a camera. Don't worry. 
Harry. We have loads of pictures of us, don't we? We have pictures of us? Where? But only when we least expect it. What are you talking about, Kel? Something special about everyone living their own lives. You're being kind of weird. Huh? Never mind. It's probably nothing. Let's keep moving forward. We gotta figure out the solution to these puzzles. That bomb could blow any second. And now I'm actually getting a phone call. Okay, didn't have to wait too long on that. So we have to cut through it. Oh, crap, I didn't mean to step on that. Okay, what do we have up here? I see how this is gonna go. This is gonna flip the one on the right. Which will allow us to access the next one, which will flip the one on the left. It's just, with all this stuff, I can't help but say it's padding. And Sapper happens in great enough frequency to where it actually is impacting the length of the game in a significant manner. It'd be one thing if it was just like something optional and kind of stupid, but it seems like this is part of actually moving the story forward. We do need to check out that teleporter before we actually take the other conveyor. It kicked us back to start, didn't it? Oh my god, I'll be back. Okay, luckily that didn't actually take that long. Maybe a minute tops. I didn't find anything, in case you're wondering, I just sped through. She could probably do mo so much for the world. Molly told us to write letters on her backs and stand in this order. At least I think it was this order. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to switch places with the one on your right. When I say you're right, I mean you as in the person standing in front of me, not some hypothetical observer watching us from behind a screen. So in case you're wondering about the B and the M part, they were concerned that they may have writ the word, written the word boob instead of boom. Haha, ha, get it. Yeah, it's not that funny. Solved. Theme, pattern, difficulty, easy. This one's gonna suck. I have a feeling this is gonna be this game's air ro air's rock. What the thing was called in Lost Age. Was it Air Rock or Air's Rock? Like, you can probably guess from me referring to it, but I could only stomach playing Golden Sun in the Lost Age once, just because the puzzles in that thing were, uh. pretty lame. We'll go with that. I really did like the first one, but the games, I think, kind of got progressively worse. <laughs> Lab work in progress. Disturbed sparingly. This is Humphrey Humphrey. Do you read me? Yes. 
Have you tried turning it off and back on again? According to her test, it would seem that sprout moles grew from tofu. Who knew? Oh my, surely these numbers aren't correct. Oh wait, it seems that I have miscalculated. I guess they're not. We understand so little about this world, so we study it. Yet our research just fills us with even more questions. It's an endless and fruitless cycle. So let's all get wasted at the bar instead. These results are quite unexpected. With this knowledge, I just may be able to find the cure for mortality. That's what I'm saying. According to the live feed, she's working hard on something in her workshop. Yeah, okay. I'll keep an eye on it. It's definitely work actually done around here, since Molly is always messing with her research. I wish I was assigned to Medusa's Quadrant. That's where they assign all the work hard, play hard types. Here they even have a water slide. So, 2402. Of course, this calculation is so simple when you put it that way. Anything up here? So, if I multiply the result, subtract by infinity, then divide by zero and carry the one, that would bring me to an imaginary number. Indeed, it would. Nuclear waste. Sweep, sweep. Mumbo Jumbo. Can't believe I signed up for this. Greetings, visitors. Would you like to see something cool? This machine here can perform remote teleportation. With the power of modern technology, I can send the sprout mole to the other side of the grid. Take a look. What the? An error? Someone must have messed with the program. It's probably Molly again. She always pulls stunts like this. So that's four. And a fish bag of potato chips. How symbolic. Hey there, visitors. I've been leading an experiment on Humphrey through Humphrey movement. You come just in time to watch us conduct our final test. Are you ready, gang? Let's do it just like we practiced. Th this wasn't my plans. Where'd everybody go? through the metal plates for me? just want to test something. Why don't you discuss amongst yourselves and vote? Cal, of course. What, what do I gotta do it? Fine, but I don't have a good feeling about this. Nothing can go wrong, Cal. Nothing. Be careful. I don't trust this guy one bit. Watch your step, okay? If it gets too serious, I'll back you up. Aha, I knew one of those spikes was broken. I had a cup of coffee right now and I'd sip it. Thanks for voluntary risking, voluntarily risking your life. Well, I guess now I gotta go fix it. I think this segment's probably going to be multiple videos at the rate we're going. <laughs> Hello, visitors. After months upon months of hard work and toil, I've successfully created the first ever Humphrey hologram, hologram machine. Don't they just look like the real thing? Could be more proud. Okay, so two is the real one. 4862. Molly told me to stand here, but I don't know why.
Go on, we believe in you. Four. Eight. Oh, crud, was it four, eight, six, eight? We'll finish this one in the city, but we'll do it. Memorization. Finally, room without a waterfall. This bright white light is perfect for my summer tan. Yeah, I didn't learn anything from that one. So it was middle... Right... seems kind of green there. Blue, green, red. White. So that actually went ex exponentially faster than I thought it would. Oh 
Hopefully this doesn't take too long. How long is this going to take? I don't have all day. My sentiment exactly, sweetheart. My work takes patience. Stop talking, darling. I need to concentrate. How about now? Almost done, darling. And finished. And last. My greatest invention is complete! Now speak! Speak, my beautiful robot! I think it's a foul mouth. Oh, well, that doesn't sound right. So I must be off with the code. It's because you made me rush my work. Instead of to love, it now must be uh, programmed to kill. Don't blame this one on me, she's your robot. Next to my hopes of finding true love have been shattered. You've disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. My, what a handful. Well, she's not my problem now. Forgot that girl. She owes me a payment. I must catch her again before she leaves. Let's go the middle route. Once we hit Mari, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna have to evaluate this. See if it's gonna seriously be like three different videos, or if maybe I can split it up somehow. This looks like a job for Aubrey. Life gym. Wonder if they're saying I'm supposed to be dying a lot here or not. Snappers with no armors in the game, you really will end up uh, needing more healing items. Strange growth. Will regenerate after being smashed. No ordinary houseplant. Nothing special about it. You can trust this one. Okay, so we need to move this one to create a bridge. Intelligent growth. Will conveniently transform into a bridge after being smashed. Didn't hurt to try. A book in a language you cannot read. Telephone calls with the wazoo. Welcome. Marina is not currently seeing anyone right now, but if you're enjoying the exhibit, feel free to crawl into a cage and wait for the next available experiment. You'll know when the screaming stops. first experiment. She made me out of sand and fruit when she was just a baby. What would you like to do? Poke it. That tickles. A table covered in goo. A box filled with goo. Can we actually climb up that? Oh well. Nowhere near your houseplant. Its leaves are hard and brittle. Full of knowledge in a language you cannot read. I'm reading a second experiment. She made me out of clay and rocks when she's just a baby. What would you like to do? We'll pet this one. Paying to school. But I like handshakes better. Whatever you say, this guy. Sprout mole.
Crazy this sounds, but the water mimic is actually less annoying than the uh what are we gonna call the sprout mold decoy wannabe poser clone something or another. Combo meal. There's going to be a picnic and some conversation, so... Well, hello there, Aubrey. Looking cute today. You always take such good hair, care of your hair. Do you need, my, do you need me to help you with anything? I'll cost you love. Okay. I guess we might be able to go forward a little bit more. Dang, what happened here? This place is a huge mess. Looks really dusty. It's probably been like this for a while. Looks like it used to be an office or something. Wasn't this supposed to be a layer full of sea witches? None of this stuff looks witchy at all. I mean, we are basing this off Sweetheart's sources. I don't know if I would trust Sweetheart, much less her sources. We gotta stop Sweetheart. She's definitely up to no good. We do? I mean, we can always mind our own business. Oh, is that what we're doing now? Protecting the world from evil? How fun! What does protecting the world from evil have to do with Sweetheart? Have you met her? She is evil. Fair point. Well, I guess someone's gonna do it. And unfortunately, that someone is us. So yeah, I'm gonna be taking a break here, as you might hear the commotion in the background, and I'll see you guys somewhat soon, I hope. going to try to get all the achievements here, but there is one I was reading that you get for petting all of the experiments or whatever. I think I poked the first one, but you need to pet all of them in order to actually get that achievement. Who did that? Show yourselves, yada yada. 
the reason why this is a little important is by poking one of them, it will cause it to fly off, so as a result, you can't get it anymore. So everyone's happy now. Except maybe then. But the other thing I wanted to talk about is... What the heck? Oh. Can't tell if she has the advantage or not. She just hits too damn hard. We are supposed to be close to the end of the game. There's, like... Some continent I haven't come across just yet that we kind of have to go looking for. I'm just going to do the attack again because I want to speed this along. There are multiple endings to the game, but I'm not going to go crazy for these because, like I said, I hate the combat system. This is not good turn-based. <laughs> So I'm putting out the word of warning now, when I get to the credit, post-credit review, I'm probably going to tear this game apart. So for those people who are fans of it, just be aware of what's coming down the line. This kill has come back now. Level 50 is the cap, so we're getting really close to that. I'm suspecting that, yeah, I probably was supposed to go do side quests or something before we actually came here, which is why I'm getting so much EXP, but they didn't tell you anything. Makes Kill happy if he gains flex. Yeah. Tools for research. And same thing there. Books filled with knowledge in a language you cannot read. I am Marina's fourth experiment. She made me out of dirty apples when she was just a child. I think this one's going to scatter. Oh? Okay, enough. Maybe not. Remnants of an old office. If there was a shortcut or something, maybe, but... W here. Hold chicken, that's one of those big healing items from what I was reading. To be honest, with my 25,000 clams, I'm still not sure this is really going to do anything. In case you're wondering, yes, there is an achievement for doing the whole clem thing. I'm just going to ricochet to try to speed this along. I found out that there was an instance where everyone could get a stat boost. We've done hell and Aubrey's. Aubrey's is real early in the game, where you can headbutt from early. Kells was with Pluto in uh, Last Resort. I believe Omori's is also there, it's just I didn't find it. And then I'm not sure where Heroes is. Oh, 
he's the one that takes off. So regardless of what you do, he bounces. Hence, you gotta do the right choice the first time around. Plans for a failed experiment. I'm Marina's seventh experiment. Though the numbers do get money at this point. She made me out of birds when she was just a teenager. This contributes to my abounding happiness. Okay, so we need to go get the one from down there to create the bridge, I'm assuming. Got the computer part, got the air horn. Uh, for the recycling thing, you have to turn in 40 pieces in order to complete that little side quest. I also found out that I missed some stuff in the real world, but to be perfectly honest, the way the real world stuff is playing out, I do not consider that a loss. You had to go tutor someone on day one, and then that's for all the plans, universal happiness achievement. I think I missed some other stuff too, but like I said, I don't care. I'm not getting into the game as much as some people did. I'm Marina's eighth experiment. Probably. She made me out of moss and bean sprouts when she was just a teenager. Do I have to push this forward? Like, does it go to a third location if I hit it, or does it go right back? It just goes back. Hey, look, it's a flower crown! Oh no, all the flowers are bruised up. It... it looks kind of familiar. I wonder who this belongs to. Do you think we should try to return it to them? This flower crown is in pretty bad condition. I don't think anyone would want something like that. Yeah, maybe you're right. What'd you do that for? It's fine. You heard what Hero said. No one wants something as bruised up as that. But it used to belong to someone. Kicking it off a cliff is just mean. Why? The flowers grow back anyway, don't they? Alright, calm down, you two. Kel, apologize to Aubrey. Fine. Sorry, Aubrey. Apology not accepted. fight the muscles, I think. <laughs> huh. So that didn't send it where I thought it would. Oh well. Okay, I'm re-recording this part because it's stupid. So we need to hit the ones that have the upside down smiley face thing, whatever. Visibility is crap, and if you pass up on any of the items, they are permanently gone. So hit that one to create the bridge. I don't know if you get anything for busting this, but I will. Um, any items, like if you get caught and you have to restart, you forfeit those items. The reason why that's important is there's so many things here to whack that we're going to be cutting it a little close. We get heartstring. And I may have to take a capture here. <laughs> the D-pad on the Xbox controller is utter crap. So we get the watermelon juice. I'm going to see if I can get behind it. Got the blunder, which is for hero, and gives you the move refresh, which almost cost me. So this is putting everything back that you took. 
Now this only partially resets, but the thing I have to warn you about is you do lose health. Some of the things do stay the way they were when you last touched them. and then you're... you get an item. la -dee -da. I will go back into the previous room so you can see what all happens. Anyway, we got the heart string. I don't know if that's an accessory or what exactly. Dig at the blender. So yeah, this one's just like a complete upgrade in every single way. <laughs> the main thing though is the more juice, that way if you have hero use the healing items, you just get a little bit more out of them. Anyway, that's good enough. And then anything you don't take, there'll be a copy of what's-his-face here saying I ate all the melons or whatever. So I'm not sure if I actually missed anything. I think there were only the three there. I don't know what the significance of that one is, though. Since we did get them, we don't have to worry. I do want to speak to the bird here, though, because when I saw the thing ate everything, I just reloaded. 667. Do not poke glass. Eh. It might be possible to do this all in one go, it's just you have to be able to navigate it around the circular part back there. Lady, just sit back and relax. You feel nauseous. Uh, oops. Well, that'll do, I guess. Alright, it's done. Here you go, lady. One perfect suitor coming right up. Say hello to your new soulmate. And no. Is this some kind of joke? What do you take me for? I have ten times, no, a hundred times more people than this thing. You disappointed me greatly. I'm storming off. Hey, what the heck? You can't just storm off, lady. Where's my money? Good question.
this point. We save a little bit of juice by doing it that way instead of just messing with the whole snack time thing. Sand of Waterfalls Current. Watch this. Yikes. Except for that guy, I guess. Well, that's just natural selection working. Hey, you know what? I think I just had an idea. But if we gather enough Humphreys, then maybe we can use them for a bridge to the other side? Hey, I was supposed to say that. Well, there you have it. I guess I could top everyone off. like an achievement for doing a certain number of picnics or something, I'm not sure. Mari, this chilton is delicious. What's it made out of? I'm not sure, Kelly. I've just been scooping it off the walls and floor. Do you like it? You... what? Just kidding. I made it by mixing fruit. And, um, gelatin. Gelatin being insect parts. Okay, yeah, but what's gelatin made out of? Well, Kel, gelatin. Gelatin's made out of gelatin. And insect parts. I see. Well, whatever. Food is food, I guess. And insect parts. Hmm. You see an antenna in there, Kel? So the one downside of doing the picnic crap is that it does reset who your leader is. Feel work in progress, do not disturb. in Medusa's sector, pride ourselves in being the best of the best. Anything in here we can drink? Colorful potions, flasks, in all shapes and sizes. Medusa treats us well and feeds us regularly. We can't say the same about Marina or Molly. Well, the Humphrey from Marina's sector keeps disappearing, so she keeps asking Medusa for more. Hope I'm not next. Biology is my worst subject, but that never stopped me. This looks like a job for Kel. And of course he's on the other side. Well, we're gonna be looking around with Kel's leader for a little while. I'm gonna avoid the snot bubbles if possible. I don't know if they chase or not. They don't. It's just not worth the effort of dealing with exploding enemies. Hey Humphrey, you wanna join your friend Humphrey at the waterfall? Of course I will. Never thought you, I thought you'd never ask. I will do the ricochet trying to make this a one turn deal. Almost missed that 200 damage crit because I had to look at my phone.
if there's a trick to dealing with that or what, and I just don't care. So we now have Last Resort and Dazzle. I never looked up Refresh, but I have a feeling I know what it does. But last Resort's right there. Based on Aubrey's heart, but Aubrey becomes toast, so you basically throw whatever HP you have left, which is absolutely worthless. There has to be some sort of multiplier on that to even make it seem feasible on paper. Anyway, we got Refresh. Wow. 50% of their juice for 40 is actually pretty big, but the downside though is this is not going to synergize with this weapon because that's based off of a snack. Uh, what was our other thing? Dazzle? That could be a little handy, but most of the bosses are single charges. So that's what makes that thing not as ideal. Join your friend at the waterfall, if that's what everyone else is doing. plant here. Aw, oh, it's so cute. Kinda reminds me of something. But I can't remember what. Oh, no use sitting around staring at the wall. Let's just be on our way. I just think Medusa's experiment has a 14 times 7 plus 44 divided by 11 minus 2% chance of success. I genuinely don't care to sit there and figure out the order of operations crap. Slime Bunny's gotta go.
snack time here. Mumbo Jumbo. I actually want to see what these cheeseburgers are picking up even do. Are they actually worth the headache or hassle of using in battle? Two fifty. So yeah, it's can't think of a good other RPG equivalent, but yeah, it's decent for this stage of the game. I don't know what their HP is going to max out at. We get a life champ for our trouble. You can tell Medusa's mad because she'll pace back and forth. She'll never yell at you, but still, it's pretty scary. Got a globe, which would be a weapon for Kel, I assume. Look at that accuracy rate, man. You lose it on juice, but... Right now, I'm definitely gonna give it a shot. Just an ordinary houseplant. According to my calculations, Reen makes you smart.
Greatest masterpiece. Mumbo Jumbo. So, with this, I think we need to go back to the previous screen.
hanging around here. You can't be this hand, me. I'm going all in. Call in your bluff. You can't fool me, me. Bring in a book about air conditioning. It's very informative. A lot of hard work goes into keeping my physique. I'm trying to relax, but I can't stop thinking about this really interesting book I read about air conditioning the other day. You know what I'm just crazy about? Air conditioning. Ain't it the greatest? What a nice looking pool. No, Snaily, don't do it! Snaily, no! see what happened, but... Got an onion ring. It's game. Match three guys for a prize. going down in a different route and see if anything comes up. Like, are we 
you're supposed to be looking for a certain number of Humphreys, maybe? Slime is starting to become a real hazard. We should really start thinking about hiring one of those clean Humphreys from one of those clean Humphrey from Molly Sector. So Humphrey is the plural of Humphrey. Go figure, right? The producer and her sister has been researching the world for centuries. These books are the fruits of their labor. Books filled with knowledge and language you can now read. Microscope. Can't examine that one. Pages of research for a language you cannot read. Colorful potions and flasks of all shapes and sizes. Okay, so the candelabrum that is just there to illuminate. It's not actually like part of their plan or whatever. 
Pages research, language you can't read. Can't read. No matter how many times I do this experiment, it never turns out how it's supposed to. Guess it's time to refer back to the manual. Absolutely horrendous in here. How much longer is this going to take? My nose is quite sensitive, you know. You will get used to the smell. Now hush, I now hush doll, I am working. And it is done. Finally. Hello, my perfect suitor. Wake up. Don't touch the glass, you buffoon, you've ruined the experiment. Well, I Than me, but I see that you do not understand that. You are nothing more than a hack. This was a humongous waste of my time. I'm storming off. Oh, I've had enough of your nonsense. Clyde, now you really struck my last nerve. Who taught you to run your mouth like that? Now, if you'll excuse me, this is a waste of my precious energy. I have much more important matters to attend to. Don't you dare walk off first. I'm the one who's supposed to storm off. Poor perfect heart. The way they treat her, you think she's gonna become a super boss or something. My ma, what's with all the commotion? Must be some fun activities going on downstairs. A slimy key card. So. Do you want to go downstairs now? Yeah, why not? Yet, doll. We just want our payment, darling. Can't you see how upset Marina is getting? Where's my money, lady? Give me my money. Oh, it's sweetheart and those sea witches. There's no way we're getting caught in the middle of this. Let's make a run for it. Stop her where you are, children. I must correct you, as you are sorely mistaken. We are not witches, but followers of science. It's a common mistake, I'm afraid. Humans tend to fear what they cannot understand. Besides, 
I think I know why people think we're witches. Hey, what are you looking at me for? That aside, we have a bigger problem on our hands. That's right. Where do you think you're going, sweetheart darling? You owe us a big, big bag of clams. As if you three peasants are worthy of payment. All I wanted was for you to make me a perfect match. But you've all managed to fail me in three different ways. If you're so insistent to get your worthless clams, let these children cover the charge. Where do you think you're going? Humphrey, stop her now. She went out the back end, didn't she? Yoo-hoo! I am here to report that Sweetheart has been disposed of. It's a good thing you asked. I was afraid that I wasn't going to be able to hold myself back any longer. Also, this may or may not surprise you, but Sweetheart had a total balance of zero clams on her. Zero. Not a single one. Which is quite unfortunate, as I am getting a bit... hungry. That wench double-crossed us. I knew there was something fishy about her. Well, not necessarily. She did say these children would cover the charges. Oh yeah. In that case, she's definitely paid her due. Which parts of them should we sell off first? Don't be such a brute, Marina. I'm sure she meant the kids would pay us, not that we should sell them. Alright, darlings. Now be good and hand over your big, big bag of clams. Huh? So, uh, yeah, about that. Just curious, how much does she owe you anyway? Let's see here. There's consultation fee, initial fee, setup fee, inspection fee, service fee, cost of materials, warranty fee, disposal fee, shipping and handling, gratuity, cancellation fee, damages, late payment fee. So that brings a total charge to about... a million clams. A million clams? We don't have that kind of money. Oh? Just too bad. Humphrey, seal the exits. Tough luck, kids. You walked into the wrong whale. Sub's gonna pay for all this. I would say desperate times call for desperate measures. Don't you agree, sisters? This one is too pretty to sell, isn't he, Molly? I like the quiet one. He would make a great pet. Don't you touch him. Let us go now. We didn't do anything wrong. Ooh, feisty. I think you'd like this one, Marina. Well, I guess selling one will just... just selling just one will do. Hey, let me go. If you kids can't pay us in clams... You can pace with your arms and legs. Kel, no! Let go of me. Put me down. Put me down. What the heck? He bit me. Settle down, Marina. It's just a little nibble. You'll pay for this, brat. Well, now it seems you got Marina all worked up. Her little prey is biting back. Guys, looks like we're going to have to fight our way out of this place. Oh? It's a fight you want, is it? It's been a while since my last hunt. Yes, it seems like our prey needs to be disciplined. Someone needs to teach you children some proper manners. For prey, you're all way too picky. You don't want to be sold. You don't want to be pets. You all should really learn your place. Well, whatever. That's fine with us. There's always another option. If you're going to keep resisting, you'll leave us with no other choice. I'm afraid we'll just have to... turn you into chum instead.
So before we actually get started, I have to go away, so we'll pick up here in a second. Okay, so I went away for about an hour. Back now. They're just one enemy? What? Unfortunately, I already hit the record button, so I can't just duck out and pretend this never happened. <sighs> we'll queue up that one. We're gonna have him annoy Aubrey. So what I'm going to do is I will actually use the jacks here to try to lower their speed, I think. Right in the heart. Okay, speed down. And defense down. So I'm just going to try that. We will do a headbutt. That's a lot of ricochets. If I had one more level, I could actually do six without having to uh, fill up. Heal up Amori. It is game over if Amori dies, I should probably explain that. Sometimes he'll hold out with one HP, but it's not a guarantee. Chainsaw is actually really good for us because that counted as three separate hits. And I'm probably gonna need to find something for a hero that uh, gives him a speed boost so he goes before the enemy. People are saying that speed control is imperative for the secret boss. And we were up to eight points. are more resilient than expected. You know what that means. It's time to get serious. I'm having so much fun! So I'm not gonna let them get emotional control here. Kinda messed up if that's even a thing, but hey. It's a slight damage increase, but nothing significant. Hero's dead. Well, at least I can afford the life jams now. Use a snack on Aubrey. We're looking for hearts. Like as much ramen as I have, I really could afford that. Give her a hot dog. So we want him to attack, her to counter, him to ricochet, and snack time. And I like, I don't get the whole juice thing. Oh, that is a load of crap. Uh, I 
I'm just throwing button crap. I don't even know what trip does, to be honest. Hey, Medusa, you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes, sister. I think it's about time we switch things up. Just relax, children. This won't hurt a bit. Yeah, that wasn't really a bad thing. <laughs> <sighs> so we do need to replenish our stock. I'm gonna do a power hit here to try to lower their defense. Right here we need to use an AoE heal snack. Fries should suffice. Then we can patch everything up with the snack time. Kel's the only one that's actually in any danger right now. And we actually do have speed control now. Sucks that I pushed the wrong button. has to work over a sizable range. That's the only thing that makes sense to me. You can see speed control's already lost, so I have no idea how long these debuffs even last. It's one of those things where there's just no clarity in the display, and it's kind of annoying. So we're going to do the counter here. Basically hoping that they don't do their stupid AoE again. Sad that that is so comparable to the release energy attack. Oh no, my old 
almost empty juice is all gone. They missed Hero entirely. I'm just going for the win. Like, there was nothing I could do to actually get in front of that attack. If they were faster than Kel, that's literally it. Kids are a lot tougher than you look. This is much more trouble than it's worth. What a predicament. How will we feed Humphrey now? And there you go, 9,000 EXP, 999 clams, and more you only get level 32 off that. Slime time is over unlocked. Man, what's wrong with us? This fight should be a piece of cake. Forget hunting. I'm not cut out for this kind of nonsense anymore. I'm just... going to stick to research from now on. Well, dolls? Seems we were all past our prime. If only we were 200 years younger. Not to alarm you all, but I'm afraid my appetite is getting much, much, much bigger. Yeah, yeah, Humphrey, we got you. Molly, feed Humphrey some clams. Huh? I'm sure I fed him last time. Besides, I used all my clams and software for the last job. I'm getting hungrier. Okay, fine then. How about you, Medusa? Well, I... I wasn't expecting to feed Humphrey again so soon. If he serves me correctly, isn't it your turn to feed him, Marina? Wait, is it? I thought it was Melia's turn. Pretty sure it was Medusa's turn this time. Well, well, well. Seems you all have run into a bit of a pickle. If you can't feed me, I guess I'll just have to help myself. No, not the melons. They were so young. My furniture! What are we gonna do now? Humphrey's gonna digest everything. Perhaps we should plan an escape. Before we expended so much energy. Perhaps it's finally time for us to swim with the fishes. Yoo-hoo! Don't worry, they're fine. Seafood. Delicious. Humphrey's out of control. How are we gonna get out of here? Keep going, everyone. Let's look for an exit. This looks like a job for Aubrey. Door is locked. Hmm. How about over here? Door is locked. Oh, that's not a melon, that's a statue. We don't want to be eaten. Well, it's a little too late for that, isn't it? 
You should have thought about that before you walked into my mouth. It's no good, guys. I don't know if there's a way out of here. Don't say that, hero. Yeah, we can't let it end like this. Oh, there's no need to struggle, children. And again, it always is more satisfying when you prepare your own food. Now, you all just sit still. Preparations have already been made. Dinner is being served, and you're on the menu. Time to feast, and feast, time for you to be deceased. At least they're kind enough to heal us. So this is considered a single enemy. I'm just gonna do the sadness thing right out of the gate. can annoy himself. Try to trip him here for speed control now that I know what that move does. Kel annoys Kel. Kel is now angry. No one likes Kel when he's angry. Can't get any sadder. See, so yeah, I guess I don't even need to worry about the sad poem or whatever. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna make everyone angry here. Once we have speed control, I'm going to try to save up for bigger things. So I'm really curious what the ricochet is going to do here.
damage applied after the status effect thus giving me the boost. I'm gonna annoy Hero here just because he'll take less damage.